Yeah. What does changing the context mean? It means it means first you have to have the thought that the context is somehow influencing. Yes. Second, you have to have the thought that there's there's a difference between possibly, you know, a negatively influencing context and a positively. And so you're making a distinction between those things. And those are systems made up of parts. Mm -hmm. Right. And then and then you have to say, oh, OK, now I have to move from I have to change my my surroundings from this kind of surrounding to this kind of surrounding. So, right? Yeah. And that starts at when I go shopping at the grocery store or when, you know, I, I choose things not to bring things into the house. It starts with changing my friends, you know, who want to party all the time or whatever, right? It starts with, right, the way that you come up with the action plan is to think differently about what the problem is. Yes. So thinking is driving that action plan. That's right. Otherwise, you wouldn't know what to do if you didn't yeah. think about it. Then there would just you'd just be it'd be like tumbleweeds. You'd just be like, <laughs> how do we like? How does a person know what that means? Thinking. Well, yeah, that's the the, the classic story was uh, we were. I mean, you'll remember this yeah. but many many years ago. Uh, we were in, doing a case study in a classroom. I forget what grade that fifth was. Grade. Fifth grade. It was fifth grade. And I see you know the story right away because we've told it so many times. Um, this The teacher was saying, I, you know, show me your thinking. T tell me about your thinking. Really think about emphasize. It. Think yeah. about it. Think about it. And the little girl came up to her and said, you know, Mrs. Uh, Smith, you keep saying, you know, think about it. Just think about it. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what you mean by that. What is thinking? Yeah. And it's an absolutely brilliant question. What yeah. is thinking? Yeah, uh, it's a question that we that our research has spent all of our thirty years of research has spent sim simply answering that question. Well, I would say, and that was a pivotal moment for us because yeah. that was early on, and we're like, oh, wow, we should probably start at the beginning. Yeah, like, what does it mean what does to it mean? think about something, to think something through? So what we know, thirty years later, is thinking is we distinguish between this and that. And we're doing that constantly, every day, every minute, every second of every day, we're distinguishing between this and that. You know, even to take a footstep, we're distinguishing between, you know, a, a, an unstable landscape and a stable landscape, yes. like a floor versus rocks or whatever. I mean, we're, we're distinguishing with our tongue, we're distinguishing with our ears, we're distinguishing with our eyes, and we're distinguishing concepts with our brain. Yes. So we're, we're constantly making distinctions between identity and other. So that's the D in DSRP. Mm -hmm. We're breaking things down into parts and grouping them. So we're yes. breaking stuff and we're grouping stuff. Right. That's part whole systems. Breaking it down and integrating it up. Yeah. Yep. So that's the S in, in DSRP. Mm -hmm. We're constantly relating cause and effect or, or action and reaction. Like something happens and then something changes as a result of that action. And that we call that relationships. So we're constantly relating things. Well, we're looking for connections between looking for connections. Stuff. Yep. And we're doing all that from from our or from different perspectives. Mm -hmm. And when we change the perspective, we change the frame. We change the things in the frame, right? Just like when a, a yeah. you know a director goes like this. Mm -hmm. When he changes the frame, he changes what's in the frame. He changes how things interrelate in the frame, what's seen, what's not seen, right? The distinctions, all that kind of stuff. So when we answer the question, what is thinking? When we answer that little girl's question, mm -hmm. the answer is thinking is the process of organizing information to make meaning. Yes. Or mental models. Mental models and meaning are the same thing. Right. So we take information. We organize it in DSRP ways. Meaning we distinguish it, we relate it, we group it, yep. we look at it from different perspectives. Yep. And that In a very is... dynamic process. DSRP is yep. very dynamic, so it's not this and then this and then this. We did no, yeah, sorry. Episode on buckets. But, you know, so we take information out in the world, we organize it in a particular way, and out of that we get meaning or mental models. Right. And that process is called thinking. Mm -hmm. That's yes. what thinking is.